As phase one is just around the corner, Berkeley students are deciding which courses to add to their shopping cart. According to Berkeley Time data, Wealth and Poverty is the class with the biggest enrollment demand. For all the semesters it was offered, Wealth and Poverty was over-enrolled by the first couple of days of Phase 1, with over 300 students being placed on the waitlist. We asked students what makes Wealth and Poverty so popular in Berkeley. You have a campus where people are fighting for the underprivileged and minority groups and um, the people who are directly affected by um, the split in between wealth and poverty in the United States. It has this perspective about like how we got here and where we are and talking and it's something that affects every student right like how you're in like how you grew up and where you grew up and like how much money your parents had growing up. I interviewed Robert Reich, former U.S. Secretary of Labor and Berkeley professor teaching the campus-wide famous class Wealth and Poverty. One reason students want to take the course is that it uh, connects the dots. It shows uh, the ways in which politics, economics, history, and sociology are related to one another around a particular and growing problem. Students here at Cal seem to be more concerned about the issues of inequalities of wealth and income and political power. Berkeley's a super political, liberal environment. I think students want to engage in those topics. Um, it's just kind of part of the Berkeley experience. And I kind of felt like I had like an inherent responsibility to like familiarize myself with these types of issues so that I could become a more informed like public citizen after I graduate and enter the workforce.